Shall we move to our seats too? Nah, it's good. Okay then. So how was your day? It was fine. Work was nothing special. I finished my proposal early so I could get out of the office. Plus my boss was in a really good mood all day. I thought your boss was always a happy-go-lucky person. No, oh, he is. But today was happier than usual. Not sure what happened, but it was great seeing him smile so much. What about you? Any problems with your latest client? Yeah, this one's a pain in the ass. You know those memes that depict terrible clients? Well, she fits all the bills. I could go on forever claiming about her, but that will help me a bit. You should make a meme about her. <laughs> and here's my current project for a minute of laughter. That might be worth it. You should ask Footsie about how to deal with any annoying clients. Oh yeah? How do you usually deal with any annoying customers? Ones you don't need your fist to take care of. Oh, I have my own methods. It wouldn't make wouldn't be wise to talk about customers to other customers. And that's one good lesson to learn of a day. Your parents. Yeah. So you've talked to them then? I did. Didn't end well? No. What did I say? A lot. They won't give us any chance at all. Anyone but an elf. That's what I said. How about you? <laughs> More or less the same. Going to invite my old man. That's why I'm staying at Farron's place now. They kicked you out. You don't have to do this, you know. They're a family. Can't stand even one more second of being a part of them. I might not have a stable income, but I can manage. But still. You don't know what I say about your last talk last night. I'm sorry. What do I say about me? About my race, I assume. Forget it. I want to know. Just the same old shit. Wondering about how elves are holy creatures. About our amount of mortality. But even if I outlive you. What? Oh, nothing. How about, about, if, about how if you outlive me? No other elves would want to be with an elf. It's already been tainted by a lowly succubus. That's exactly what they said. This is it then. Be in no relationship. It doesn't have to be. You know our families will never agree. We can we can just continue like this. What do you mean? I don't need to know what we're still dating. We can just continue the way we've always been. Without them knowing. Then what? Do you want to be hiding a relationship for the rest of eternity? We're not like humans, you know. We can't just elope. And you won't get permission because you're too old. Lua. I don't care about their permission. I'll be glad to serve my family ties if I have to. I can't let you do that. You lose your mortality. If I get to spend my life with you, I don't mind. I don't mind a bit. You're making this hard for both of us. Do you feel happy when you're with me? Of course I do. But you don't need any more reasons. You know we're perfect for each other. You don't even need to look deep down. Trust me, we can do this together. I can't think about this clearly right now. We'll talk later. Wait. I'm sorry to listen to our problems. That's alright. This coffee shop has seen all kinds of stories. I do hope yours will have a happy ending though. I hope so too. Do you have any alcohol? Sadly, no. That's a bummer. Well, do you have anything that's warm and can calm me down? Do you like green tea lattes? Green tea lattes? Yeah, I'll take one. So, green tea, milk, milk. I will give you a bit of a um, latte art. 
I've actually hidden my mouse now, so you can't really see it anymore because it was getting distracting me earlier. Let's try. Tentacle monster. Try back there, and we need to do. Uh, let's try that. So that. Here's your green tea latte. Oh, this is good. Thank you, this. By the way, are you married? For me? No. Do you have someone you love? I love this coffee shop. Not sure that's not the answer you're looking for. I didn't really have any expectations. Man. And all the people in the whole world, why don't I fall for her? You can't choose who you fall in love with. You can if you try hard enough. At least, that's what my old man said, anyway. He's really one pretentious elf. But I guess all of them are, really. Entitled, pretentious, immortal douchebags. At least you have an eternity to learn and change. Or an eternity to be an eternal asshole. Anyway, I need to go now. I'll probably drink myself one until the sun rises. Oh, it's still a while until sunrise. More time to drink then. See you around. See you around too, Miss Freya. Thank you. Do this again. <sighs> you were listening from a corner? Yeah. Poor souls. I do hope I find a way to be together, though. Me too. Anyway, I need to leave. I'm going to get up earlier than usual tomorrow. Okay. We're going to close the shop up after this. That's pretty early. I know. After the rest of the deliveries come in tomorrow, I'll open as usual. Okay. You have a good night then. You too. Yeah, drown your troubles in coffee. Cafe latte. A caffeine boost dominated by milk. Go for a latte right back now. The evening whispers. Zombie virus from Africa may have reset, reached Seattle. Seattle groceries distribution problem. Harm local restaurants. And fire plan to enforce strict regulations. Manage illegal immigration. There's nothing to click around here, it seems. Let's start the day, shall we?
Good evening. Oh, good gracious. What's wrong with you? Uh, can't you enter just like a normal customer? I'm sorry. But I'm so excited to share with you. What are you talking about? I know I could write about my novel. It's one of your impulsive temporary ideas again. Hey, don't be rude, I'm being serious here. Okay, okay, just tell me. What are you going to write about? A coffee shop. What? I'm going to write stories about this coffee shop and people who come here. Are you for real? Yes. And what if I say you can't do that? I'm not asking permission. That's like a breach of customers' personal lives, you know? Relax, I know that. I just need some inspiration from this place. Stories themselves will loosely based on what I hear and see. How loosely based? Knife Walker novel versus m movie level loosely based. Knife Walker novel versus movie level loosely based. The old one? Of course I'm talking about the old one. Hmm. That's still very different, you know. You can't get more different than that. I mean, it's not like I can tell you not to write about a coffee shop, right? No, you can't. Or you can just ban me from coming. Okay, you're banned. Huh? What? I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that to my loyal customer. Very funny. Thanks for not banning me, though. Anyway. I'm really excited to see who's going to come tonight. Wonder what kind of stories I'll have. Good evening, y'all. Oh, good evening, Officer Georgie. Hey, Pop. Seems like you're in high spirits this evening, Miss Freya. I'm pleased, Fuds. No need to have fun with me. <laughs> We're both on duty here. Hence the formalities. Ah, oh, you're as stiff as ever. Anyway, I have a shift tonight. So I need the usual. You have all the ingredients today? Not everything, but more than yesterday. Except for tea, I'm out of tea. You still remember my favourite, right? Coffee. With a hint of sweetness. You got that right. Make sure not to use milk. Yeah, yeah. Thanks to your Tomodachi profile, everyone knows you're lactose intolerant, Georgie. Anyway, a cup of sweet, healthy coffee, please. So, Georgie, friends only, close friends only, birthday. Freya. Interesting. I love Freya's profile picture, don't you? Gala, still no idea who he is, but um. Lua. Oh, I absolutely love Lua's profile picture. Birthday, 2nd October. Voto ame es un passage chaussé. No idea what that means. And Bailey's? <laughs> That's so fitting. Uh, freelance designer and number one pumpkin spice fan. Wow. So what do you have today? We have coffee. We have ginger, honey. No milk, definitely no milk. Increase of warmth, increase of bitterness, on it's sweet. Sweet, healthy coffee. Let's try it, shall we? Honey coffee. There you are. Coffee and honey for your man and Judy. Not everyone can manage this combination as well as you. Thank you. 
By the way, I haven't ordered anything myself yet. Find me with service like you gave your old pop here, please. What are you having? You still need to ask her. You never know. Espresso, of course. The one and only espresso. A starless night sky for a green haired fairy. Not even sure whether that's my compliment or not. But this is perfect. So how's the thing going up the paper, Miss Freya? As usual. Awful. She's making a whiskey deal with her boss. Ah, pretty much. What kind of deal? A possible life-altering deal. A very dangerous one at that. Okay. A deal she regretted. Not that much. Folks, seriously. You care to share the details properly? Oh, you tell him. She's secretly using her working hours to do something else. Something like... Writing her own novel? You got balls, I can tell you that. She does. Gee, thanks. How's the leap of faith going so far? Not slowing down, that's for sure. I don't see any haystacks to fall into. Good luck with that. I know, well, he's not losing a job at least, not yet. And I've been really hard if she messes this thing up, though. Oh, thanks for reminding her. So, yeah, as Flood said, my chief editor doesn't know about it yet. And my novel's going to be published by a parent company anyway. So, technically, I'm still doing work for a company. She'll be really pissed if she finds out, though. Wait. Stealing time a com is, is stealing time a crime? Technically, I might have to arrest you. <sighs> hey, you do it all the time too, you know. Oh, these are just coffee breaks. Sometimes it might take longer than we're meant to. But still, coffee breaks. You know what? This is too a coffee break. Thanks for watching, guys. Join me next time for some more coffee talk. So until then, bye-bye.